Hello everybody, welcome back to Reviewing Shark, and today I'm going to be playing Subnautica Below Zero. Um, it's been out for a while, um, it's not entirely, like, fully done, but there's some updates done so far. Dodge being here. What are you doing now? Alright, so I had to stop watching here to calculate how long this video is to make sure it doesn't go over two minutes. Alright, so yeah, I have played this before, um, a while back, and the video ended up being 35 minutes long, and it wasn't good at all, and it, just, the game's updated now, so I figured might as well play with the new creatures and updates, I guess, so let's just start a completely new game, I'm even gonna erase, it. okay, Bowser's story is now fully voiced, we recommend starting a new game for the best experience, let me see, okay, so, start a new game, it's under heavy construction, but we're going to do it now because I, I don't have any other videos I did. We're going to do survival. Whoa, okay, that's... Actually, I think I... No, I, yeah. I was about to say, I think I remember. Um, this is loading screen. Before I did that. Wow, it's like a giant spaceship with a bunch of asteroids around it, or meteors. And I guess that planet that they're close to is the planet of Subnautica. Which is a real planet, I figured out. It's just an ocean I really hate, and the fact that there's oxygen and things can live on it. I freaking hate it. I have terrible aquaphobia. Like, I used to be scared of going into pools. I used to go to my aunt's house, and they had this pool in their backyard little waterfall and they I didn't know if it was like a pool cleaner or something but it's a little shark thing that it, it was pretty small it was like that big barely that says my brain you swim around I was scared to crap us of it all right I first can this is the furthest that I could take you on company space bucks Robin you sure you want this the research is in everything it is to me and Sam I need to know what happened the meteor storm I can use it for cover from Altera's eyes <sighs> I'll find my way back. I just realized I was talking that entire time while the volume was at a hundred. You guys won't be able to hear me. Well, let's hope so. And if, if you guys can't hear me, I have to add subtitles and that's good. Let's hope you guys can semi hear me. Sense. Approaching 45 46 feet. Surface temperature is drop pod deployed. Well, that's a bit stupid, eh? What were you expecting? You got right up close to the asteroid and said, What could go wrong? Mm -hmm. Standing in fire. Oh, I'm playing now. Welcome Great. To 45, 46 feet. Enjoy your stay. For, oh my god. Run. Can't go this way. I can run. Okay, I can run now. Thank you. Oh yeah, we're on. And these Welcome things. Four, five, four, six feet. Oh, I miss Landing these things. A bit rough, but. I don't think Altera spotted me. I hid from the satellite. The drop pod deployed with us. Just have to find it. Oh, also, sorry if you hear background noises. Headphones? Oh, that's why. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. I'm sorry. Alright. So, you guys are probably pissed off. Oh no! I didn't mean to go in the water. I'm scared. Oh 
I'm just going to this thing. Okay, I'm going to get oxygen here. Found the drop pod. Okay. Who are you? Okay, you guys can read this if you want. Oh, wait, hold on. Who's dead? Okay, someone named Sam is dead. Oh, that's our sister. Oh dang. Whoa. Are you wearing no works? Things I said? Sure up here. This is our new PDA. We don't work for Altera? Okay. How do I Well get Sam, over? I guess I might as well gather some tools and resources before starting my search. Hope that radio tower is as easy to spot as Lil said. Radio tower? Okay, so I guess our main thing now is a radio tower. Can we build? I know that's a really important part of this game. Um. Ooh, a flashlight survival knife. It's pin. Re oh, pin recipe. Ooh, and that, oh, that's so cool. Oh, that that's that's so neat. All right. Oh yeah, I was gonna say it doesn't stay there. Oh, no, it doesn't. Alright, so I should have pinned the recipe for batteries. Electrolytic materials that can be used in energy storage. Should be able to use this. Use what? It's a very delayed voice line. Catch water fish. It's like a special one. Okay. New creature discovered. Why am I holding it like that? So you make water out of these. It's from bladder, okay, you know, be free. New blueprint synthesized. Right. Oxygen. Dang it. Oh, I gotta make it. I'm trying to die. Wait, no. All the penguins are in the title screen. Remember, these got teased a while ago because when the first map guy came out, I looked up all the creatures in the game. Um, but for the second one, I didn't want that to happen. I wanted to be shocked by the new creature models, so I stayed away from them. But no matter how much I refreshed my YouTube page or even pressed not interested on the videos, the thumbnails on the videos that would appear with like new creature leaked and stuff and had the penguins all over the title screen. You know, like gameplay shots, I'm like and by the time the game actually released, I saw Corex Kitchen's uh, video on it. I watched a little and that's how how I got the game. Or not how I got it. But I was very uh, like, it would have been so cool to start up the game and see the penguins and be like, what are those? And they're obviously penguins, but you know. But I'm stupid, I probably won't be able to tell. Oxygen. Again, okay, yeah, we need oxygen. I was just seeing my birds stepping on the spacebar. I was just gonna. Just okay, yeah, I'm dead. Might not be actually. Barely. Well, dang. Alright, so I don't see anything new from the updates besides better graphics and smoother gameplay, which which is good. But I heard there's some new creature models, and I think you have to travel a bit for those. So I'll see if I could travel a tiny bit this episode. I'm gonna make this like a 15 minute one, so it's not half an hour and some. Alright, so we need a battery and some glass. Oh, oh okay, you just hover over it. Yeah, I, I am a stupid. Okay, I can get a scanner. Uh, that's not the biggest thing at the moment. I'll do that when I feel like I'm upset. Do need. Yeah, I'm gonna pin that recipe. Um, this one, standard O2. Yeah. Silicone rubber. Few vine sample. We need a knife for that. So, knife. We need silicone rubber. How do we get that? Okay, now here, you have to open this up. How do you get silicone rubber? Oh, the cool stuff. Okay, those are easy to get. You can only carry a few of them. I think they take up four spots. Oh no, we have a lot. We can carry a few. I always need one. Oh, I think I found some. No? These are the Cree vines, right? 
Also, I heard there's ice worms in the game now. Well, they've been added a while ago, but they got a retexture. So, or like a better model. It was like less pixelated. New blue Before, what? I don't even know if that was English. But yeah, so I mean, this seems like a full game now if it's fully voiced. That means full. Oh, what the heck are you? Sea monkey. It's fully voiced, meaning if the game's fully voiced, the game has to be somewhat for them to add fully voiced game. If that makes any sense. Basically, they can only fully voice the game if the game is fully done. Or besides, like models uh, looking a little bit better or uh, making bigger bases or something I don't know just things for the game to make but besides that the game has to have an end so far or a, I, I mean you could technically still play it but like some kind of ending right now I think that was in the game before there was an actual ending I don't know why I made that that actually made no sense of what I just said so just I don't want to didn't I get it? No? I was in here. Yep, Silicon Rubber. I, 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 I was too busy talking about stuff that didn't even make sense. I'm, thin. I'm not too worried about that. Survival knife. Just gonna will it take it off? How do I unpin it? Unpin. Okay, there we go. Unpin recipe. Go. Uh, some glass. How do I get glass? Wait, nope. Right, I need two quarts. I need another one. Yeah, it's getting dark. I should probably do it. This episode's almost getting. Dang, these episodes go so fast. No wonder the last one was 35 minutes. I feel like I just started. Oh, there's a lot of stuff down here. Of course, there's a rock over. Oh my gosh. Or yeah, ice chunk, sorry. So, oh, we have temperature now. I guess that makes sense considering it's below zero and we're in the water. What's well, the suit? Has like heaters or something in it? But I would probably attract other animals. Whatever. I don't know math. Titanium. My phone fell over. I'm using it as a stopwatch. Where is my sure bird? Is there? Oxygen. Okay, yeah. There's. It looks a. Yeah. Okay, yeah. That looks a little better. So I could actually see some stuff on the surface, where it's still kind of snowy. Okay. What is that? Where are those? Are they still just? Yeah. They're still just flat paper models. But I mean, it gives off the illusion. You can't really interact with them. See, they look pretty cool. I would recommend uh, making their the models a little longer in length or whatever, just to kind of see kind of like the peeper. You can see the back, uh, like the back and the front of it. You can see it's like wider, I guess, and instead of just being really flat. You gotta, I would, for the sort of the fish, you can do it, like, make it a little wider. They look like they're actual, like, fish swimming by. I, it does give off the illusion, but it make the illusion a little better. Glass. Alright, and then the flashlight. Auction tank, the one thing I should have been making this entire time. Alright. Wait. Okay, now I was gonna say, this is the same thing. Did I already start with Star Wars? Ooh, whoa. New animation? See, the game is basically done. So, yeah, I guess what I was saying earlier about the fish models, that's really. This is really just the model length, and that's literally it. I mean, besides so far, this area. Pretty solid game. Just re release it for Xbox. I know a few of my friends really wanted it for Xbox, and 
none of them could get it because it wasn't for Xbox. Oxygen. And actually, I didn't get Subnautica, uh, Subnautica, yeah, Subnautica, for the computer until a few days before this one came out. I actually got um, Subnautica for the computer. New but I didn't even plan on it. The moment I saw Queer X Inches video, I ran up to my Xbox and looked for Subnautica. I didn't find anything. I was like, what? I thought it was out. I went on Steam on my computer. I'm like, if they could put Subnautica, the original Subnautica on Xbox, I I would say they could release Boy Zero there too. I would be very surprised if they couldn't. Or they, it's fine if they didn't want it. But if they, if they couldn't, like, if we're real, like, there's circumstances, there's circumstances. I don't know. Oh, I keep forgetting words. New blueprints oh, okay, it's already equipped. Oxygen tank can be upgraded for deluxe and VIP breathing. VIP breathing? Come on, could be a VIP to breathe? Bruh. Alright, so before this video ends, it's already. Minutes. This girl's looking at that. Yeah, it's been 16 minutes. This is 15 minute episode. I think actually I I would probably be responsible and end it here. So you know what, what I'm gonna do? I'm actually gonna film part two right now. In case you guys want, I'll release it later this week for editing. Um. So yeah, this is part one of Subnautica Blow Zero. Hope you enjoyed. See ya.